Normally I do establishment and restaurant reviews, but I thought I would do something a little bit different with this video. I know a lot of people were making this huge uproar over a certain product at this one bar that I go to. And I thought I would make my own insight on this situation. I know this local place, not everybody's gonna know about it. <laughs> However, this could be a great stop if you're just passing through the area. Hi. I am Susie J. Cobwebs, and this is my writing channel, and I like to talk about different aspects of starting a brand from scratch. Now, today is going to be one of my featured playlists, and that's my establishment and reviews of restaurants or restaurant-like things. So if you like this video, I hope you check out the rest of these videos in this playlist. I go to mom and pop restaurants. I go to different restaurants that I feel that I could get a good customer service, a good ambiance, a good experience, or at least I hope. And then I go there, I enjoy my evening or my lunch, breakfast, whatever the case may be. And then I will talk about it. Now, this video is going to be about a food that is close to my heart. If you know me, I enjoy a good burrito. It doesn't have to be Mexican. I could literally put anything in a burrito and I will be happy. Mexican burritos are good. Don't get me wrong. I will talk about them in other videos. This video is all about the talk of the town type of burrito. I didn't even know this even existed until numerous amounts of people would come over my house and they would tell me about this infamous burrito, how they enjoy it. They have to talk about this burrito with me, right? They said that the, the worker there will cut it in half so you can have it for two people. Like, I heard all different kinds of cool things about this burrito, so I needed to check this thing out. So, you have a burrito, one, up my alley, two, possible for two people. Great. Yay. Cheap, easy meal for two. I'm all for. I decided I was going to try this thing out. You never know what's going to be the latest craze in the area. I'm not really a trend follower, but you caught me at burrito. If this was going to make my life better and my life happy, I'm all for it. I was willing to give this a try. I went over to this place and it was between shifts. Their workers were trying to make sure that they got the last shift all taken care of while the new shift was coming in and all nine yards. You know how that works out. They had to make sure that they got the different hoagies and the different wraps and the other alcoholic beverages to the people that were sitting at the bar. And then there was a stand over onto the door where you could just kind of go in and order whatever you wanted and you can get your hoagies that way. You don't have to be at the bar. Well, I got this burrito. It was called a Dorito burrito. Well, we all know when you have a huge burrito, you need a gazillion napkins, even if you're only eating half. The stuffed burrito, for the most part, was filled with mayonnaise, pieces of chicken with a few extra additives, and Doritos. I know. I know. This, in my opinion, only, as I'm saying this as a disclaimer, this, in my opinion, I was not a huge fan over. I think it may have been too much mayonnaise to my liking, or the Doritos were too, too much for the burrito. It was edible. It wasn't bad, but I don't think I'm gonna try that again. I will try another item on the menu. Now, I have tried numerous amounts of things in this establishment. Nikki's Quick Six in North Vanagrift I have had many, many different other hoagies and different things in this establishment and they are to die for. I was just not a fan of this burrito. I know I will go back for the Italian hoagie. I know I will go back for the pizza hoagies. 
Do you have a place in your area where you like to try different things on the menu just for something different, even though you've tried all kinds of things on that menu and a lot of them, they were great, but then there's other things that you don't care for. Do you hold it against that restaurant or do you go back to find something different? Can you comment that down below? If you like these videos and you wanna see more of these videos, by all means, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that post notification button so you can stay on top of all the different things that I post. And to the next time, love you bunches.